very early on it became clear that the babies with microcephaly had calcifications in the brain. So we knew it was infection. And there's a list of infections that can cause congenital infections and microcephaly, and we exclude all of them. It was none of them. So it's a new infection causing microcephaly. Why it started to move? We don't know. There's a lot we don't know. But it could be that the virus had some mutation that made it easier to transmit. It could be that just more global travel, people travel more. And if an infected person moves from a country to another country, then mosquito in the new country bites the person and can transmit. The symptoms are uh, fever, low fever, uh, rash, um, tiredness, uh, pains in the joints or in the muscles, and more specific of Zika, a lot of itching. It's a very uncomfortable couple of days. And then uh, red eyes.